The Introduction of LS236 Car Paint Meter LS236 Car Paint Meter is compact and portable with dual screen design for easy reading. It employs durable Ruby Pro and can avoid the deviation result from the abrasion. It's easy to operate and is ready to measure when switched on. LS236 Automotive Paint Meter is responsive that it only needs 0.5 seconds to complete one measurement, which helps to quickly test the whole car. The data is stable when measuring the same position of the car more than once. How to tell if a used car has hidden repairs using the LS236 car paint meter. Generally, if a car has been painted in a repair shop, the thickness of the coating will increase and if a sheet metal happens to a car, there will be scraped on the car with ferrous putty. When the paint thickness of the car is very abnormal, you can tell that the car has been repainted. In order to disguise a repaired used car as a new car, some garages will intentionally use ferrous putty to repair the vehicle to escape the inspection from most car paint meters on the market. However, LS236 can recognize this situation. When discovering ferrous putty, the screen will turn red and indicate ferrous putty, accompanied by two warning beeps. The instrument can identify galvanized iron car body in automatic mode, the screen will turn green, as well as vehicle bodies of iron, aluminum and plastic. The instrument can work normally in the minus 40 degrees Celsius environment and is super resistant to low temperatures and the top screen is not frozen or become white screen. How to set the measurement mode, language and unit. Press and hold the power button after switching off to enter the setting interface. Display languages are Chinese, English, Russian, and Turkish available. Short press the button to select the right language and long press the button to confirm your choice. The instrument has three measurement modes. FEAL means automatic measurement mode. FE means ferrous substrate mode. AL means aluminum substrate mode. Here are two units micron and mil to choose. Enter the measurement interface after selection. How to complete a zero adjustment of LS236 car paint meter. When the meter can't recognize the ferrous putty or iron galvanized body, the ambient temperature change greatly, or the battery replaced, LS236 need to complete the zero adjustment. Zeroing needs to be carried out on the iron and aluminum zeroing plates, both of which are indispensable. The method is simple. Hold the notch with your fingers, press the instrument vertically against the plate press and hold the power button for threes until the screen appears prompts. Follow the prompts. When the screen shows the data 0.0, .0 a zero adjustment is complete. Test the plate again, and 0.0, .0 value indicates a successful zero adjustment, then testing a standard film to verify the accuracy of the meter. Next, start a zero adjustment on the aluminum zeroing plate and repeat all the above steps. Some cautions for using LS236. In FEI measurement mode, you can only test the paint thickness of the iron car body, but not the paint thickness of the aluminum car body. The same in the L mode. The LS236 is ideal for testing the paint thickness of used cars and inspecting the quality of vehicles.